Hi folks, welcome to my Bit Retro Journal. This is a quick clip, five minutes or less. This is kind of a late entry into Septandi. Um, last year, uh, I did a video on my Model 3 where I tried to format some floppies, but they tend, ended up being high density floppies and it didn't work. Well, I got my hands on some low density floppies and I want to give it another try. So let's head to my Model 3 to see if I can get it to work. I've booted up my TRS Model 3 with uh, TRS uh, DOS version 1.3. And uh, this time I have um, a uh, true basic disk, which is definitely low density. So um, I did make a backup of this, and uh, I'll take a picture of the disk. And I'll put it on the Internet Archive side. But what I want to see is, can I format this? And this does this label has come up a little bit, so hopefully that won't impact anything. So I'm going to do, first of all, just stir to see what's on there. Maybe you can actually see the disk. It recognized something on the drive, but it just couldn't. Uh... Yep, it's on here. All right, well, let's format it, see what happens there. I still don't know if that drive is actually good, so and we're just going to say one. And that should just ask me for the name of the disk. I, I still don't know if here is um, uh, Model 3's Here's DOS's syntax very well. I just know the basics. Yeah, I'm just going to say yes. Oh, it's going through the sectors and verifying each. Okay. I think that's what it's supposed to do. So that's good. Writing system information. Okay. It format. Wow, this is my first format, so I should be able to say one. Yeah. Uh, and then zero is that. So uh, let me just try something here. Zero. Oops. Zero uh, LPC CMD. Yeah, I'm trying. Uh, I I don't know the syntax yet of uh, how to. Uh, what I want to do is copy, but I don't know how to copy it. I mean, do you just say copy LPC CMD to uh, like that. Oh, all right. <laughs> Look at that. Uh, that was just okay. Uh, copy. Uh, mem. Oops. Test. CMD to. One. I don't know if that's the same as a disk copy though. And then I want to copy Hertz 50. But uh, both disk drives are working, so that's good. And last one copy HERZ50 PLD to one. It did say copying system information. So I guess my question is, can I reboot with that disk now? Because did I just create a bootable disk, which is kind of what I wanted to do all along. So let's grab this one. Let's grab that one. And let's put this one in. Not a system disk, yeah. So uh, I still need to know, learn how to do that, but I got kind of excited really quickly. So that maybe there's a, a command uh, on format that creates a system disk out of it, or there's a clone. Uh, I'm a novice at this, but I know that both these drives work now. So that's good. Uh, took the right um, density disk. I'm just going to quit here, uh, and I'll investigate more, and uh, there might be uh, more to come in a, in a few weeks. So thanks for joining me, and um, I'll see you soon.